hello friends welcome to another video tutorial and in this tutorial we are going to build a video call app using zigo cloud so in the meantime don't forget to like and subscribe let me give you an overview of what we are going to build okay so this is the app we are going to build so i'll put name code wave and copy this link right the link that you can share so i'll open another uh, browser or in incognito and paste that link. Um, code wave two. I just click on join. Okay. Then let me put it side by side. Okay. So you can see the two apps are connected, right? And there is an option to even send a message. So if I send a message here, wait. You can send a message here. Great. Don't forget to like and subscribe let's get started okay so when you come to zigo cloud here it says build faster and ship uh, more with ui kit so i'll leave all the links in the description of the video okay let's explore it so zigo cloud has some many products right like video call um voice call live streaming uh, in-app chat cloud um recording ai effect super board and uh, digital human right so zigo class support all of this that you can use any of them to create your app and when you register you are giving um 10,000 free minutes to try it okay so zigo cloud also has support for android um, ios web um, react native and flutter so how do we register we just have to click on sign up Click on sign up and fill all the information and make sure you verify your email. Okay, so we do not have any project, so let's create a project and we are going to try um, the voice and video call right okay so select that one and go down and click on next okay so give a name to your app so i'll give a name of video call app okay and uh, i'll select web here right okay web then i'll click on start Okay, so our app is creating. Okay, so we can start our app now. Okay, so I will select, it has support, as I say, it has support for many. So uh, we are going to use um, for web. So I'll click on web. Okay, and this is the kind of uh, uh, UI okay, that we got, we get. Okay, so there are one-on-one -on -one, uh, call and group call. So I'll select group call. So we can have many uh, layout, right? You can leave the info configuration, the R grid and the auto as well as uh, sidebar, right? Okay, so I'll leave it to auto and leave all the settings then click on start and uh, save and start integration. Okay, so the app will create and will go into the configuration. Okay, so this is the layout we'll get, right? Okay. So note uh, your app ID and the server secret here. We will use them in our code. Okay. So uh, note them. I have hide my own. So uh, note them. Okay. We will use the app ID and the server secret. Okay, so when you come to your dashboard, you can see your app is here, right? Okay. And the app ID and the server security is also here. We'll be using them. Okay. So now when we come to the documentation, the documentation, right? Okay. So what are we going to use? We'll use NPM. We we'll first need to create our app, right? Then we we'll install uh, this. Okay, great. 
So we're going to use Vite to or Vite to create our app. And the command is simple like this. Okay, so just copy it. Uh, I have a folder, an empty folder open in Visual Studio. So I'll just create the pro project inside it and I'll put dot slash to create it inside the same folder. Okay, I'll select React and JavaScript. Okay, so then I'll install all packages, npm i or npm install, right? Okay. Okay, so we'll copy this and go and install it. Uh, while this is installing, let's look to our folders and uh, we need to get rid of the app.css, we will not need it. Also, in the index.css, I'll remove all and just put this uh, styles, a pattern of zero, margin of also um, zero, and box sizing of border box. Okay, okay, that's simple. And inside here, you can remove this. Okay. Okay, so now let's install the Zigo Cloud API or the UI kit. Yeah. So click on paste it and just press enter. Okay. So all we have to do is that now it has support for React. Right? There is React, there is Next.js, there is uh Angular and Vue. So we are going to use React. So we will just have to copy this code right and override our app.gss okay great okay okay let's override it okay so so now we are importing the zigo cloud ui kit right pre-built and this function generates um a random id right yes so this function will help us generate a random ID for each call, right? Okay. And this will also help us to get the URL parameters, right? Okay. So here, if you remember the app ID, you put it here and the server secret, you also put it here. So just copy your app ID and server secret and put them here. Okay. So if you, if you add your ID, we can now start our app by running MP or run dev. So make sure you copy the right uh, app ID and the server secret. Now let's run it. Now let's open our app in a browser. Okay, so let's open our app in a browser. Okay, so you need to allow, yeah, allow the app to use your microphone and camera. Okay, great. Okay, so our app is here, right? So you have to uh, put your name, right? Okay, and copy this link. So you share this link with anybody so that anyone can join. So I'll open another um, browser, then use that link. Okay, let me disable my microphone. Okay, also allow. Okay, click on join. Okay, so let's put it side by side so you see the two apps uh, or the two running. Okay, so now you can see that they are connected, right? Great. Now this has support for in chat so we can chat right we can send messages across to all the participants and all the participants will see right so all you need is just to give them the link to join okay great and you can see the messages the messages here you can also send and also here great okay so this is how you can build a video call app or you can integrate a video call app into your app using Zigo Cloud. Thank you for watching.
don't forget to like and subscribe and also share and leave your comment. Go ahead and register on Zico Cloud and try it. Thank you.